Hi guys, so today is going to be a little bit of like a, a vlog or Amazon kind of review thing. Um, I live in Texas right now and it, it is 102 right now and it is 7 o'clock at night and I just like I cannot with the heat but when I run errands during the day my the interior of my car is like black and stuff and you'll probably see it in a minute. And I was like, I cannot do this, it is sweltering every time I try to get in the car. And I try to get in the car with Corgis and they're just hot. So I ordered like a magnetic uh, shade kind of thing for the back windows. I didn't get any for the front windows yet. And then like a mini clip-on fan to like kind of blow the cool air into the back for the Corgis. So uh, I have the package here. I think uh, they're just both in the package that it says both were delivered. So I'm assuming both are in the package. That's what I'm opening right now. So, um, here's the fan. So it's a rear seat fan. It just kind of clips onto the, the metal part of your uh, seat. And it's just like a little USB plug. And I think it has like three speeds or something. This was only, let me check, like $11 for like this and I was like okay that's pretty cool you know considering fans can get a little pricey depending on what you're getting so this is what is in the package I'm gonna open it so, yep just like instructions oh it has suction cup too so I mean if you want to put it in the front I suppose you can oh no so there's different ones okay so yeah, that's that's what this is. There's like different ones you can purchase from them. They have suction cup ones in case you wanted that. Oh, it's got a scent thingy too. A scent packet if you want your car to smell good. So we might put that in. I don't know. Depends on how strong it is. Okay, so there it is. That was a plastic smell, guys. Oh, goodness. Okay, so here it is. This is, okay, that looks pretty convenient. It looks like you just push it and it'll just clip right on. It looks like it's decent size. That's my hand for comparison. And there's that. Uh, they say you can peel this and stick it onto your, like, your console if you have a console uh, so it doesn't move around. I'm probably not gonna do that because I'm gonna be plugging it, unplugging it pretty regularly. Oh, I said that right. <laughs> I've been having one of those long days where I just, I do not feel good. I haven't been feeling good all day. So I just haven't been posting much, haven't been doing much. I did, I got an order done. Here are the magnetic like curtain thingies, shades for the cars. And that, that's it for that bag, so. Let me get these out to the instructions. Don't really need the instructions. It's magnetic, -y. it goes on the top of the door. Or on the inside, so with suction cups in case you don't want it to like float around while you're driving I suppose but it's they're gonna be on the back window so I'm not really gonna care too much and they're semi-transparent I think is what they said so like Bella likes to look at the window of course so I want to make sure she can still look out the window but it at least blocked some of the Sun from getting into the car and like the the black seats absorbing and getting just too hot. It just, it's ridiculous. Okay, so it's already sticking to itself because there's magnets up here in the top. You can't really see, but they're right there. So this just goes uh, on the inside and we'll go put it in the car here in just a second. I'm gonna get everything ready. Cause again, it's like hundred degrees outside. I don't wanna be outside too long. I'm going to leave these inside. I'm probably not gonna use these right now. So those are staying inside. I'm gonna figure out where this goes on the fan real quick. And then we will be out in the car and I'll kind of show you what I mean about the interior and trying to keep everything cooler than just you open the door and it's freaking oven, you know what I mean? So I know baby and Bella is gonna help. We got outside. I don't know if you can hear the cicadas and stuff, um, but you can see the, the like interior and the seats are like black and stuff. And I love this car, but we live in Texas and that's just inconvenient. So um, this is the Corgi's back seat. I got this like waterproof kind of pad. And, uh, they have their own little 
like little safety buckles in here that just buckles in there and that's not about that anyway so here is the magnetic thing and let's see strong side I'm trying to do this one-handed sorry so basically yep I'll just it sticks right there and you can adjust it I suppose to wherever you want and they said you can put it on the inside right here, or the inside right here, just whatever is magnetic. I'm gonna put it right here so I don't have to like take it on and off all the time. Let's see. That's looking pretty good. So I'm gonna close the door and see how that holds up and then we will try to do the fan. And the suction cups are for right here on the... Okay, that's pretty good. Yeah, so you can kind of see it's gonna hopefully help a little bit, but the suction cups are for like the windows if you don't want it moving around and stuff. Let's go check out the other side. Yeah. Yeah, so that's what it looks like. That's pretty good. I'm hoping it'll block out at least some of the sun. And I will, if anybody's interested, I'll do like an update on it. But, you know, my car gets really hot, and I didn't know what else to do. So, we are trying out this. See if it helps. And that's just really easy. It's just magnetic. Sticks right on. No problems with it so far. I think that's pretty good. Yeah? Okay. See how easy it is to close the door? No problems. Okay. That looks pretty good. So, hopefully block out some of the sun. All right, I'm back over here for the fan. I'm gonna plug it in like, behind me. I'm gonna scooch this and scooch back in a little bit. Oh, that's cool, it just stays like that. Okay, that's neat, okay. Now the fan, I'm sorry, this is not a great video. <laughs> I gotta push that up a little bit. Okay. So, onto there. I'm trying to do this one-handed. There, oh, that was easy, okay. I'm gonna have to scooch it down. There we go. And you can adjust it like that. All right, I'm gonna get in the front seat and then we're gonna try right it out. here, hopefully y'all can see that. And I'm sitting in the front seat. And uh, there's the window shades. You gotta fix that one again, but okay. The cord is long enough and it comes right here. And I've got two little plugs right here on my car, so. The USB one I usually use to like charge my phone and uh, play my music, but this one's just for, I think, just for charging or using. All right, so that's plugged in. Here's the button. Oh, there it goes. One more, that's on high. All right, let's get out real quick. Oh. Check it out. How it does in the back. Okay, that's pretty good. Oh, that's real good. That's the highest speed. And once like all the cool air kind of starts circulating, I think that'll be really good for them. And I can kind of point it down because they usually sit like right here so they can see and look out the back. But um, that's pretty good. I would totally recommend that. It doesn't seem to have any problems. It blows pretty good. So, for I think these were 11 for the two piece, and this was $11. So, if you want to kind of keep your car cooler, I'm hoping this is going to help. I'm just going to plug this in like when the everybody's in the car and we're like running errands and stuff. So, this is not going to be on all the time. So, um, I think that's really about it. If y'all want, ooh, like an update or anything, y'all let me know. But so far, for the price, I'm liking all this stuff. The fan works. These are magnetic, uh, easy to put on. If you really want to take them on and off, you can. And you can adjust it pretty easily. And it, you know, door closed is fine. You can't see it like through the door or anything. So I think that's pretty good. Um, I think that's really about it. Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you'll enjoy it. <laughs> Just like a little Amazon vlog review. And I will see you on the next one. Uh, bye, guys.